This is a crazy grand finals. Tweak Gluto. I'm so happy Gluto did well because he's, it's France, you know what I'm saying? I like when the hometown hero does well. Yeah, I was like, that absolutely is an extra down tilt. Good damage already. So again, Gluto does have the recent set history, absolutely, but Tweak? Kind of going crazy this turn. We're rooting for Tweak on this one, I think. Same. Oh, that bike was so good, actually. I think wins for both definitely reinvigorate their talks in terms of like super high rankings. Because again, Tweak hasn't won since January. Gluto hasn't won a super major since Pound? 2022? I think Wario beats Diddy Kong and Seth. I definitely think Wario beats Diddy Kong. I don't know enough about Sephiroth, to be honest. So like Gluto has had Tweak's numbers. So Tweak needs to figure something out. Like I think Tweak wanted Spargo to win. I totally forgot that Gluto has like a really good record on him when I was talking earlier. Whoa! Down smash? Interesting. Oh, the banana drop was pretty unlucky for Tweak. They're not going to have it as like a way to get off the ledge. Up smash? Not going to kill yet, though. But has waft and is up a lot of percent. Beautiful falling up air by Tweak. Wow, Wario's item toss is really bad. I did not notice how bad it was. With the trying to catch the banana. Yep, the forward tilt there. Yeah, it's really, really hard because you need to air dodge the, the, the forward air. Oh, I like that crowd chant. Just the Wario. Wah, 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 wah. Big fan of that. I definitely don't think D uh, uh, Sephiroth beats Wario. Like, I know Sephiroth has a lot of range, but it's not more about that because also War or Sephiroth has problems with people doing good landing aerials onto him. Um, and, like, Wario can absolutely do that. Glutony winning Europe's first super major would be lit. Yeah, I think, I think storyline-wise, I would like Gluto to win more, but also I'd like Tweak, so. Like, I like both of them. Uh-oh. Oh, got the up hit. Wow, that was good by Gluto. Means the kick of the monkey flip. That was, I think was supposed to be banana. Are you dead? Down air. Wow, he made that. That's crazy. Oh, the bike. Oh my god, that killed. Jesus. And again, Gluto with another lead. Gluto having leads is so scary because if he can just get like an early waft kill this stock and then just like camp a little bit, he will have one by the time. Even if Tweak starts bringing it back, you know what I'm saying? Again, I feel like Tweak struggles in the same way he does versus Light in this matchup where he's so scared to just guess the jump. Like he's so worried about being wrong that he doesn't let himself be right at the moment. Like he tries to play super solid and like everything correct, but it's hard to just only play correct if you're if you need to like stop them from jumping on you. You know what I'm saying? He's playing so well, dude. Holy crap. What do you do? Oh that oh no, he didn't do the attack! Up B? Not gonna get the kill. Nice. <sighs> Guess right, jeez. Oh god. Oh, I don't like being in the corner there. Good monkey flips. Gets back in there though. Establishing some offensive pressure. But again, Gluto, I think he has half waft now. So obviously, I don't think he's going to be using the waft this stock on Tweak. Mm. Mm. Oh, it doesn't get the second hit of the nair. That makes sense. <gasps> Just eating the banana saying, I don't even want it. Just no, no momentum right now. There's banana. Picks it up. Up air. Oh, he didn't up air there? I thought that might have been a true combo into death. Full waft here. Oh my god. What was that, Tweak? What the? Four down tilts in a row into getting it? That was crazy. The banana being very good for Gluto right now. Great rollout by Tweak, but gets the back air anyway. Can he get this edge guard? No, he's not going to go for it. Double nair, up air. Ooh, with the IDJ, that was clean. Uh-oh. Tweak with momentum, not rolling in. You know that's what Gluto always wants. Okay, monkey flip. He's only doing monkey flip kicks because even if he's wrong, they're safer, I guess. Oh, great item pickup by Gluto. Half waft is online. He can't. I don't think he's gonna find a way to actually land it. I think he's just gonna play this waftless, or he's just gonna go for like a read like he did versus Light a couple times. Great up tilt. That's what I'm talking about earlier. Why isn't he up tilt? It's a good sign for Tweak doing that. Z drop forward air, recognizing that it wasn't gonna be the ground trip. This is a last hit game. Barrels into him. No, the first hit knocked him too far. That absolutely would have killed. Waft. And I don't. I just don't think he's gonna let it rip. Wait, how did that down tilt miss? What? 
Did y'all see how that down tilt missed? What was that? That was so weird. Back throw not gonna kill. <gasps> no, the bike hit. Oh, that was crazy. How did that down tilt miss? That was weird. It's like Diddy Kong dashed it because his dash like kind of hops him off the ground. The down tilt of Wario straight up just missed. That was insane. Well, there's a difference between item throw and bike throw. Those are two very different pieces of frame data. Um, because, uh, like, heavy items are not the same thing. He doesn't have a double jump. He should be dead. Yeah. God damn, Gluto. Maybe it is going to be a 6 out. Maybe you're right, whoever said that in chat. A heavy item throw is not the same thing as a regular item toss. Uh, like, Gl <laughs> Wario's heavy item toss is almost the same as his normal item toss, which is, like, weird. Normally, it's much... The item toss is much faster. I did say that whoever makes it from losers to fight tweak would win set one of grand, so, like, technically, I want Gluto to win, so I'm more correct. You've never seen Gluto play this good? Ah. Uh... Oh, nice forward air. Oh my god, he's just gonna go for the kill. Oh my god, Tweak made that with through the down air too? That was crazy. Yeah, that bite on the banana has so little lag. Down air. Oh my god, he drifts to the left, so he's gonna get the kill. Dude! He's much, much better at it. Not getting these. That was such a smart directional air dodge down because the beginning of the directional air dodge put Gluto higher, so he was actually able to avoid the down tilt train. I don't know if neutral air dodge would have done the same thing. Like, I think it would have missed. Luto has waft here. and Like, having waft and up a stock, that's crazy. Up smash not working. Tweak understanding he needs to pull the trigger on these out of shield options. He, he can't just be stuck in shield. Like, you can't. If you're stuck in shield, you're just going to lose to players with this amount of crazy offense. It was why, it was like part of the reason why he beat Spargo was he started uh, just out of shielding him. Gets the tech roll in. That's a 3 0 for set one for Gluto. This is insane. One of the things that you have to think about is obviously you can assume that the person that makes the banana has the better item play, right? But the thing is they rely on it. I don't rely on banana. So if I have access to banana, that's a bonus for me, right? And if I can take banana away from my opponent, then they don't have their tools, whereas I have all of mine. Does that make sense? What does Tweak, how does Tweak adjust? I'm trying to think, like, besides a lot of out of shield options, I'm not sure what Tweak needs to adjust. Like, the out of shield thing's pretty big, but I mean, Gluto's just momentum has been so good. Just been so good. That was crazy. What a zero to death. Like, what insane play for Gluto right now. This is like, this is legendary. This is, this is like, that's so cool considering, oh, that was great by Tweak though. Like, immediately just basically zero to death in the back. Has Tweak played any Sephiroth this tournament? I don't think so. I think it's only been Diddy, which is probably why he's not going Sephiroth. Because you can't really play Sephiroth, in my opinion, not warmed up. Ow! Ow! Tweak winning after that zero to death, just so we're, so we're all paying attention. Dude, I love these up tilts. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I was seeing in the fucking Sparto set. Or the light set. I was like, dude, he's got an up tilt. If he's not sure if it's ambiguous what side he's going to land up on, just anti-air him. Don't shield, just anti-air him. Like, Diddy Kong obviously can shield a lot. Same with, like, I understand it, right? With Pika, uh, you want to just add a shield because your shield's really good and your add a shield options are really good. But if you're not sure what side they're going to land on, just hit them first. And that's going to be an entire, like, swing. Two stock swing. Half waft is online, so Gluto can get a kill if he gets like a landing up air if he chooses to do it but i assume he's going to be waiting for full waft like dude it's so funny i feel like this top eight was like such the opposite of smash cons because smash cons was all a bunch of like slower defensive characters um and like wario can be defensive obviously but in this top eight like we're three stocks down and it's been two minutes this is a very fast game oh my god tweet he got zero to death and is literally just three stocking gluto since then like if that zero to death didn't happen tweet got hit like four times i would pop the f off right now but i would also lose because i would waste all of my emotional energy Again, these anti-airs are huge. He's not even shielding anymore. That's the thing. He's not letting Gluto... Like, he's just pressing all of his offense. He's not letting Gluto dictate the pace right now at all. Or, you know, trying. Of course, you're always... If you play... The problem is, if you're playing the aggressive style or the more, like, in-your-face, I'm going to act first style, you're not going to have as much control because you can just be wrong. But Tweak is a lot less worried if he's wrong because him staying in shield is already wrong, and that's what is literally happening right now. Look at this! The control and damage he's getting! I think Bike is still gone. Up tilt up air? Yeah, it's still a pretty even game. Oh, what a... 
crazy forward tilt barrels. I hate when barrels are there because you kind of like don't get to calm down between stocks or like recenter yourself. It's not fun. Good grab to armor the the banana. Down tilt off smash, not working. Luto has the control right now. Gonna try to slow it down because Tweak was slowing it. Or Tweak, Tweak is wanting to play fast right now. So I think Luto wants to play on the defensive way. Um, especially if he gets a read, he's a waft. That is a good off smash by Tweak. He gets hit by the banana. Not gonna establish the position quite as well. But again, he's still up a lot. He's still up a decent amount and he has full waft. Of course, the waft isn't gonna be influential for this stock, but it just means the last stock is going to be uh, very much scary for Tweet. Down throw, up air. Bad DI by uh, Gluto, but not going to get the kill. So again, now the game has slowed down a lot. Like, it's been a three and a half minute thing instead of like a one and a half minute thing in terms of this many stocks. Oh, good back air. And again, waft. So right now, Gluto is clearly more dangerous, but I don't know if it's going to end up mattering. Good tech and DI by Tweak to get to the platform as soon as possible. Good bite, though, by Gluto, knowing, of course, you're going to be scared. Do you drop the banana? Yeah, but now Tweak has control of it. <gasps> the Nair not hitting hit two! That would have been huge! Slightly too high percent. Oh, well, miss, missing the banana grab. Bites it, heals a little bit, but that monkey flip. We got a very even game right now. I also would have started to read not tech in. <gasps> if that hit... Ah, uh, actually, I think Tweak might have... No, dude, if he picked up that banana, that was dead! It would have hit the air dodge into dash up forward smash, I think. Oh god, 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 going under. Should be banned. Hashtag shiny mark. <gasps> it hit the two frames, so we needed to tech! Oh my god. It was an error or nothing, dude. They're both playing really, really well. Uh, well, the crowd is louder than NA. EU crowds always are. But again, even though that game kind of ended, I would still feel good if I'm tweaked based on what happened at the end of that game. Like, you kind of died to a weird thing. Uh, but the Oh, what a jump read by Gluto. That was crazy. No dull jump. I thought Gluto was just going to run off there and down there. That would have been huge. Still huge positional, positional advantage. Half waft online. Uh, but Tweak can get a lot of kills right now. But Gluto, Gluto's not really like jumping the platform that much. So I don't know if that full hop banana toss is going to really be uh, what Tweak needs. Yeah, camping at the ledge. Always going to be good versus Diddy Kong because you don't get banana confirmed. And of course, any single tilt you do picks up the bike, which kind of is annoying. Like, I don't like how that item stuff works in this game. Like I think with big items, you, that shouldn't happen. With little items, because like it doesn't interrupt your move. Monkey flip. Oh, that is gonna kill. Okay. Even stocks. Luto almost with full waft. Honestly, I don't mind Gluto always going for the roll-in. First off, it's obviously hard to hit the roll away for... Oh, what a shot with the banana! That was such good aim! Uh, because of the um, like speed of Wario, sometimes hitting tech away is really difficult, right? But then he's either way just having stage position and then just keeps his opponent in the corner. So like it's worth it in two ways. Bike is causing a lot of complications right now for Gluto. I mean, Bike, it stops the banana. Monkey flip kick is like no longer really an option. Um, so you kind of, that's really, really good for, uh, for Wario in this matchup. Beautiful parry on the second hit. Doesn't even get the punish though. And there it is, Bop. 2-1 Gluto. That was like the one, he teched in twice that game. Once with the platform, which was straight up just a 50-50. Um, and that was the first time, like, on the floor he's teched in, I feel like, in a long time. Bluto is one game away from winning the first European Super Major, the first Super Major on French soil at his home crowd. Tweak, trying to bring it back, was in Grand Finals, beat Spargo, beat Light, but Gluto has just been so strong versus him lately. Oh, dead? Oh, I don't know if the banana would send him far enough uh, in to get... Uh, oh my god, this damage by Gluto is insane, though. Oh my god. Crazy. Okay, ooh, Tweak started to tech in, like, a lot. Ooh, okay, ends up getting the punish anyway, so it's fine. Yeah, this bike, literally what Gluto started doing uh, after Tweak won that game one is just bike all the time on stage. Like, he doesn't need it to recover, it's fine. I'm just gonna be 
Oh, what a trade! Like, that up air was so good with trading with the Nair. He's off stage. He's trying to edge guard. Tweak has been very uncomfortable in the corner. <gasps> that could have been an up smash. Unfortunate. How are you supposed to know that? Of course you're not. And Bike's still on stage. Tweak has to get, in, yeah, has to get Bike off stage now. He started going into the more shield-heavy gameplay. I mean, right now it makes sense because he's at 150. Luto has the download. I wouldn't call it the download. I just think Luto's playing ridiculously well. Like, winning isn't always, like, has the download. Sometimes it's just playing better. That's, like, the third or fourth time that's happened this set. Wait, does Bike going over Banana get rid of it? That was... That's not... That's messed up. Okay, even game. Even game, asterisk, with Waff. Hit people with that in the Brawl days. Always getting that. So in tweet, in those combos, tweet does the back toss. Like he turns around and does a back toss because it's actually more plus on hit because all of the lag is at the beginning of the throw, not the end of the throw. And again, like tweet just has to respect that space, and I think he just should, especially considering Gluto already has Waff. It's not like camping's going to be worse for him. So like I think if Bikes on stage, he just needs to run away at this point. Which again, you don't want Gluto to have that like momentum. Oh my God, he got it! I saw a double jump come out. I wonder if he was able to air dodge. But Diddy with the frame 3 air dodge, I think. So, Gluto on last stop. See, like, now you don't want to camp with the bike because now Gluto is willing to camp behind it to just to get waft. You know what I'm saying? But he doesn't really have access to banana. Like, Gluto's only playing behind bike. This is so smart. This is so good. This is so good. The double jump frame 1, always. Oh, no, gets a weird air dodge? Kill with down smash. Oh, my God. Okay. Last stock, game 4. Again, if Gluto gets this game he wins the tournament tweak has to win one more after this okay 92 tweak has is shutting it down all of a sudden uh i think half dwarfed is online pretty soon though that's a problem oh no gets the bike gets the roll read yeah just gonna monkey flip to the other side not even worrying about it monkey flip back in monkey flip central <gasps> so good what a forward tilt is this game no Gluto messes up picking up the bike, tries to hit neutral get up. No bike available. It is too fresh. Tweet, yeah, not gonna go for a downer there. Down to the smash, not gonna kill. Half waft, I'm pretty sure is online. No bike. Tweak has got to keep Gluto away from that bike at all costs. And that's gonna be game four. Game five is on the way. Oh, what a game. Are y'all ready for a final game? Who do you think is going to win? One's for Tweak, two's for Gluto. Good lord, this is a crazy set. This tournament, this top eight's been amazing. This has been a godlike top eight. Again, Gluto had an early lead and then got that waft second stock. Even with a waft kill, Tweak still won that. That was crazy. Oh, back air is absolutely punishable. Tweak didn't need to, you know, be that weird with it. 80 to 51. Down tilt. Dash attack. Forward air. 50% lead for Tweak. But again, you kind of just have to have the stock lead against Wario, or it just feels awful. Tweak shielding a lot, but shielding a little bit uh, different than before, in my opinion, which is why it's been working just a little better. He's still not really out of shield optioning. Like, he's not like barreling or up smashing a lot. Banana on the right platform. Yeah, not able to get it. Oh! Okay, very even right now. Good drift behind because the out of shield options behind Diddy Kong are significantly less scary because up smash is smaller behind than in front, clearly, and it's faster in front as well. There's the bike, just trying to eliminate the kill confirms for Tweak. Still gets the banana! No hit on the air dodge in, because why would you air dodge in there? Dude, look at this bike play. It's so important. It's so, so important. I thought that was going to be a back air kill on the back dash. Monkey flip. Ooh! That was an amazing runoff banana toss! Tweak has the lead, but literally Gluto has full waft first stock, so he's absolutely going to try to find it uh, next stock. No double jump, no bike. I'm kind of surprised Tweak didn't go more in. Uh, he, he died in, so he wasn't able to get in there. Down air. Gluto can't find this kill. Uh oh. Gluto needs to find this kill right now. Monkey flip kick beats the bike. Tweak racking up a lot of percent, staying in front of Gluto so that the back air is not going to come and so he's not going to be as susceptible to kills. 
There's another forward air out of shield. Forward air again. He's being a little bit more proactive with these shields. Oh, almost got the hit on the air dodge. That would have been insane. The bike not there for Gluto. Down tilt back air not going to work. But again, tweaks pressure is insane. Gluto needs to find this kill like now. He needed to he needed to find it 40 seconds ago. The barrel's going to get him out. Tweak is impossible to hit right now with anything meaningful. The bike of all things. That's such a weird option, but it makes sense why Gluto would do it. It's the only thing that would hit there. Okay, up throw, fair. But again, a banana, a nair, this can literally be an even game immediately for Gluto. He has bike, should be able to recover, especially with the banana cover. Gonna miss the roll. Stock? That's stock. No, it's not great SDI away from Tweak. I don't think it would have been worth it, and it might not have killed anyway. He's gonna hold this waft for last stock, or he's gonna just try to find it with a reed or like a banana. Oh my god. This is crazy. Great monkey flip. That shouldn't be kill. Oh my god, it is. Tweak up. One stock at the end. Gluto has waft. Probably not going to use it this stock though. Unless he, unless he like, I don't know. Oh, he's not. He's messing up picking the banana. You got to use aerials. Crowd going alive for Gluto. <gasps> the banana. What? That was such a weird hit. Of, that was like a weak hit of up smash. Does up smash have a weak hit? I didn't even know that. Again, Gluto really only having back air as a kill aerial, and if Glu and if a tweak positions himself in front of Gluto on like cross ups and stuff like that, it's gonna be really hard. But the bite. That's a stock. We have a last stock game, but Gluto is waft. This is perfectly positioned for Gluto, but of course, Tweak has been playing really well. He's going for it. Oh, that's bad position. Great air dodge. Gluto actually committing more further off stage. He almost never does that. 92%, 103. Does he have bike? He does. Banana's still on stage. Oh, but now it disappeared. Uh oh, gave up a lot of CH control trying to find banana, but tweak 122. Banana obviously kills. Down tilt back air, I think kills at ledge. Down tilt up smash might, but also any waft. <sighs> Bike is on stage trying to eliminate these kill options for tweak. There's up throw, up air. This is absolutely kill. Oh, what an air dodge tweak. Gluto didn't read that. I'm so surprised. Unlightheaded. Uh oh, he's dead. <gasps> what a banana. That's it. That's the game. Gluto wins! Terra! The 3-0! The Game 5! I would be so upset if I was Tweak. What hit him onto the platform? Oh my god, the first Super Major in Europe, won by Europe, normally seen as the weakest region, the weakest, like, major region, I guess, in the world. And Gluto says, no, 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 this is the French dimension. Holy crap. That was an insane game. That was an insane set. The choice to not use Waff second stock paying off that third stock. Whoa, that was insane. That was so good. I got lightheaded talking at the end. That's so unlucky. That's actually so unlucky for Tweak. I'd be, I would also be upset. Because like, yeah, he's, he's upset. Like, look at this. He was kind of right. He did a jump down banana toss, but the frame data of it was like so tight. That Gluto catches the banana with the Nair. Tweak isn't DIing up, because why would you be? If you were DIing in or up, this isn't gonna happen, but I think he's DIing down there because he's expecting the down toss to hit. But instead, it catches the banana into the tech chase. And of course, like the biggest problem is you have these, like a lot of people when they're getting hit in panic situations want to tech in place because they can like get back to the action faster or make a decision faster. And unfortunately that bites tweak in the butt there. I mean, maybe this would have just worked anyway. I think he maybe had the time to just jump and waft on the two other options. Tech in might've still got hit by the banana. I guess tech in was probably your best option, but then also again, you can just get up air wafted. So like, it's not like this is a good position regardless. Yeah, Tweak obviously upset. Like, clearly upset. I think that makes perfect sense that he's, like, that mad. I don't think he threw his controller, thankfully. But Wario's a cheater character? Wario's definitely a cheater character. Wario's absolutely a cheater. He was the OG cheater. He was the base, he's the base game cheater.